Should you be worried about Social Security? Let's talk about it. Hello, everybody. Joe Warbeck coming at you. And today I want to talk about Social Security because I'm seeing it in the news and I'm hearing that people are concerned that it may be reduced, that it might be going away, that the Democrats want to mess with it, that the Republicans want to mess with it. Look, here is the straight scoop. Social Security is not going away. You're going to get Social Security. Now, if you're over 50, maybe you're in your 60s, you're approaching the time when you can start to get Social Security no politician in their right mind is going to get rid of the benefit that you have paid in your entire life. And how much have you paid in? Well, you pay 6.2% of your income up to a threshold. In 2023, that threshold's $160,000. It has changed, as you can see over the years, but that means that you have put in 6.2% of your earnings up to that threshold and no politician is gonna come out and just get rid of it. So it is going to be there, but there is a problem. In 2033, 2034, it looks like it may run short. And I've done a deep dive into this in my video about the OASDI, the Social Security Report that comes out every year. If you wanna learn more about that, check out that video. But here's all they have to do, simply raise the cap on income. Like I said, it's $160,000 now. If they raise that up to $400,000, meaning they're going to tax Social Security on the first $400,000 of earnings, that shores up Social Security well past the year 2100. And really, how many politicians are worried about something that's not going to happen for at least a decade? Very few. And remember, if you own your business, and you're paying your own salary, guess what? You got to pay the 6.2% for your own and the 6.2% for the employer. That means a business owner is paying 12.4%. And if they raise up to $400,000, that's going to be an additional almost $15,000 in taxes on people who make that much income. So your benefit's not going away. If anything, Maybe you were born in the 80s or the 90s, your benefit may be reduced, but if you're in your 50s or your 60s, you are going to get your Social Security. Don't make your decision based on fear. Don't take it early. Check out some of my other videos about when you should take Social Security, how to get the biggest benefit out of it. So there are some simple fixes out there, but please don't make your decision to take Social Security early because you're worried it's going away. It's not going to go away. It's going to be there for you. If you like videos like this, make sure you subscribe, check out some of my other videos on Social Security, leave a comment down below, and as always, I'll see you next time.